Welcome everyone. So today we are going to solve a very nice indices problem. A lot of people got it wrong. The reason for that is because see here there is a variable involved. So in order to find the value of x minus 7 the whole square they have given and 49. So in order to find the value of x we need to take square root. But please understand when there is a variable involved you need to put your final answer in terms of what plus minus 7. Okay, so here if x minus 7 was equals to plus 7, therefore value of x would have come out to be 14. And if x minus 7 was equals to minus 7, then value of x had to be 0. Now let's try and put this value over here. So if I'm putting value of x as 0, so 0 minus 7 the whole square gets you minus 7 the whole square which gets you 49 which is correct. And if we put the value of x as 14, 14 minus 7, the whole square, that gets you 7 square, which is 49. That is also correct. So I can say value of x is either 14 or 0 for this particular question. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.